Welcome to the madhouse. <laughs> sometimes what is going on ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another video we're doing another week of preparation for uh, LA Haunted Hayride and the Queen Mary we are going to both events this week it is gonna be our first time at the event both of them actually I've never been to either one so I'm excited to go through both of them I'm excited to see what the Queen Mary has to offer excited to see what LA Haunted Hayride has to offer but today we're gonna to be looking at our top six most anticipated mazes for the Queen Mary uh, Dark Harbor in Long Beach, California. I have a list. I've read through all the synopsis, and I uh, kind of wrote down what I think are going to be the my top six most anticipated. So let's uh, go through all them. We're going to go up from starting from number six, which is going to go to Feast. Now Feast is like a, I guess it's about the chef and stuff like that, and how like twisted and demented he is, and what he cooks with like I guess people or something like that. But I, I. It's pretty low on my list because I don't know how I feel about a, a chef being like a killer or something like that, but we'll see how it is. Like I said, and not, any, uh, I've never been through any of these mazes, so they might all surprise me. Number five, they're going to go to Intrepid. Uh, Intrepid sounds kind of um, kind of weird because about it's about this like guy who's obsessed with the Queen Mary, and this witch makes him like gives him like body parts that are like made out of the ship's metal. So I'm, I'm curious to see how they're going to pull that off and, and see what uh, what they use for the makeup and for the costume for this character. It looks, it sounds interesting, the story, and the character could be very interesting if they pull this off right. Number four is going to go to Lullaby. Now Lullaby is going to take place in the pool section of the, in the ship, which I heard is really haunted. And I, I'm curious to see what we're going to see in Lullaby. Now, of course, there's Scary Mary, the antagonist behind the... Uh, that, that part of the ship so I'm, I'm assuming we're gonna see her and, and this one they said they're gonna make you feel like you're underwater this time around so uh, I'm really curious to see how they're gonna pull that off and if I'm gonna get or see or feel anything of a ghost in that area I'm a little terrified of that but I'm also kind of excited to see what that has to uh, bring to the table so yeah number three because I'm a sucker for all things clowns usually is circus now I love the ringmaster and the ringmaster was cool the one year. I love the ringmaster and I, I, I think the ringmaster was cool the one year that I went. So for the ringmaster to be having her own maze of, of, of course the circus, uh, I really want to see how they can uh, do this, how they do their adaptation of a circus because we've seen Knots do it, we've seen Halloween Horror Nights do it, never seen Queen Mary do it but I heard they've been doing it for years and apparently it's a big success because they keep bringing it back and I think that's really cool. Number two is going to go to B340. Now, this one sounds really interesting. This one's about, I guess, um, this character went berserk and went on a murder spree when they were in the ocean. And uh, he, like, killed, like, a bunch of people. And then they arrested him and put him in cell B340. And then when they went to go check up on him, he escaped and he was never found. His, his cell was filled with blood, scratches, and the, the, the murder... Uh, the case went like as a mystery it never got solved so I'm curious to see how they're gonna pull this off if we're gonna go into B340 I'm really excited to see uh, the scenery for this maze the story behind it and I cannot wait to see what this has to bring to the table and number one is gonna be going to Rogue now when I heard the maze announcement for this, this is gonna be a new maze at the event and when I heard the maze announcement for this I was actually pretty excited because this one says that you're gonna be going in like a ship that's supposed to be sinking and like the crew and captain are still behind and stuff, but they're all like twisted and demented and stuff like that, which I think is pretty cool. And it, they said you're gonna be feeling like the ship going down and stuff, so it's gonna be like a kind of like an interactive one where you're gonna be feeling like a, like if the ship's going down. They said you may get wet, and and I and I'm all for that because I got wet a ton at Halloween Horror Nights, so I'm excited to see Rogue come to the event. And this one's gonna be based off the captain, a younger captain, uh, and I, I I can't wait to see. Uh, what this maze has to offer. That is going to do it for my most anticipated list for the Queen Mary Dark Harbor. Tune in tomorrow to see my most anticipated list for LA Haunted Hayride because another week of videos is coming your way. Thank you everybody. Thank you for subscribing to the Madhouse. Thank you for joining the Madhouse. If you guys want to follow us on social media, Instagram at the Knights of Horror and 
Twitter at Knights of Horror uh, to contact us or just say hi or whatever. Follow us to keep up what's going on with the channel. And I will see you guys tomorrow.